It is a frosty morn. Bank holiday Tuesday after Boxing Day, Christmas 2016. Lovely and frosty on the bracken. And we're out here in the woods. Not really for a mooch. So much as a social. And uh, brought the catch box and we're going to light a fire. And frankly, got bacon and some chorizo and bits. <laughs> See a red button on the screen. This is Adam Rayner coming out of the forest <laughs> with the firewood that he's collected with his bare hands. Yeah, I was going to bring some gloves. Say hello, Adam. Hello, Adam. <laughs> <laughs> and this is our spot for the day, a beautiful spot. We're being very grown up. A lovely Christmas spirit going on. <laughs> so a little, little campfire here, Ooh. all of our necessities. I bought marshmallows. And Adam's got the marshmallows, which is good. <laughs> and we will come back to you shortly. OK, well, you can see by the heat haze that we appear to have a fire lit. Delicate sounds of military helicopter disappearing into the distance. Oh, reloader. I can tell you that that's uh, Mr Alex Rosier. Yeah. And we've been joined by Mr John Jeffries. And all three of us are playing hooky from our women. <laughs> I can't believe we've come to play silly buggers in the woods. With men. With men, yes. And a large piece of a pig. That is outrageous. You really can't be cooking all of that just for us right now. That's, that's ridiculous. Either that or like take a whole bunch of wood cooked pig home. And uh, well, we've brought some various bits of stuff with. Mostly by the dink dinky noises, as you can tell. Catapult targets. Let's uh, pan around the woodland. A little bit of a natural bowl here. It's a lovely winter anticyclone here in the Surrey Hills, and it looks absolutely beautiful. Let's just uh, look how far away that target is. John, what's the name of that company? Great Fun Targets. Great Fun Targets. Is that with a GR and eight? Yes. Great Fun Targets. That was sponsoring. Young Alex, uh, it only goes down if you bock it on the boco. And uh, he's sponsored by them, so it's a big shot in it, you know what I mean? But we've also got, uh, that's quite a distant one. Uh, just showing off now. Down there, some uh, more spinners. Let's zoom in again, I found them. Whomp. And uh, over there is a quietly awesome view of the Surrey Hills. Got surround sound wumping steel ball bearings here. Huh? What a lovely spot. I have to admit that uh, Alex had to bully me into getting off my fat ass and getting out. <laughs> As you can see, lumbering, <laughs> the lumbering bear in the woods, collecting bits of wood and that. But, but yeah, I bought me um, catch box too. So. Hey, there's worse things to do on a Boxing Day Boxing Day, isn't there? Because this is the Tuesday after Christmas, which would have been the Boxing Day holiday normally. Uh, Alex Rosier not even realising he's flipping the bacon about on cue and dropping it in the fire specifically for. <laughs> not bother about that. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, there's there's worse things you can do. Just sitting in the woods, cooking bits of pig. I'll tell you what, actually, right, Alex, right, uh, he turns out to be right posh. He says, uh, would you like some brie to go with your bacon? I'm going, are you effing kidding? <laughs> he pulls out a French cheese. Oh, she is now, even now, comesting. Sean's like, brie with bacon? What? <laughs> this, is bacon. this is Surrey, come on. Brie and bacon. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Jesus, look at that. Giza. Oh, I've got an even better selection of spinners than that up now. There's the smoke goes across the clearing. I can see into the uh, slight distance there. I hear folks, chap, don't distress anybody. All festooned around the trailer. 
I'm going to get the catch box out there too in a minute, so I'm going to have a go at all. Well, I've been having a go, but you know, with a little green toy. Mmm, the fire's died down a bit. And, uh, it's hilarious. I was just going, oh, isn't it lovely to have all this space all to ourselves alongside what was quite clearly a space where people like come and ride bikes and stuff. And of course, there's some youngsters riding bikes, but me and the Rosier here. And uh, Yo. got it immediately into. Oh, I'm going to cut some skewers oh, and we sticks. Are, it's going to do uh, Ray Mears mode Hunter, over there. John Jeffries. Yeah, because cause we've got something really important and very outdoorsy to do at Bear Grylls. It's actually. <laughs> no, it's it's a packet of marshmallows. Or maybe some chorizo, isn't it? We've got some chorizo. We've got some chorizo. <sighs> It's hellish, but you know. This is again, what we do. Yeah, it's great fun. It's a lovely Chris day. There's that bit of frost still on the ground over there. And it turns out I'm not that bad a shot with that lovely pocket poacher mega grip. Although, Alex Rosier, you are offensively talented with any frame you get. You dial that in, spinners in rows, you're an arse. Got that <laughs> one on target now. Yeah, man. There were so many people say. What hit what? We go, ping. Who was that? Was that you? Well, we've eaten all the pig. Had an absolutely hilarious event. I'm afraid we did the full Henry VIII and threw the ribs out into the undergrowth, which is a bit stupid because these two chocolate Labradors appeared. And they gave not two stuffs about what their owners had an opinion about. And they just wandered around in the undergrowth until every last one of those ribs. Because from their point of view, they could see these with their noses clear as a bell. Stuff their faces, crunch, crunch, crunch. I feel a bit guilty. Yes, take even your bones home with you. Dink. That's been lovely. This is, of course, a bit of shared woodland space here. People come here and mostly they ride their mountain bikes about. We've had about four or five parties of folks appear, and we just well, anglers sharing a canal who've uh, kind of there for boating. This space here seems to be mostly about people riding their bicycles. And today it's been about bit of Boxing Day catapult companionship with my mates, isn't it? All right, geezers? All right, boys. <laughs> yeah. Boxing them away. And uh, thank you to your girls for letting you come Reset. out to play. Reset. Go playing woodlands, go play doing fires, and, and we cooked we cooked marshmallows. Oh, God. And a significant, measurable fraction of a large, white British pig. Thank you, Alex. No problem. No problem. Okay. Bent measured by the life of a fire. It's getting a bit dark now. And I think uh, Alex and John approved an estimatory final shots than me. Especially with some insane long range can shots. Still think it was hilariously funny that. A pair of chocolate Labradors appearing. It was, uh, it was like a Fenton job, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it was funny. Fenton! Fenton! Jesus Christ! Fenton! Except the bloke was trying to act casual and failing. Taking up that one. Yeah, man. So, the uh, most frustrating target of the day, chaps, was, of course... Spinner on the wall. Spinner on the tree. Spinner on the tree. Been on a tree with a little puff of smoke each time you don't hit it. Yeah. No, you're yeah. supposed to say, like, you know, the name of a man's sponsor and that, because in actual fact, that is challenging getting a cranio monster on that void thing, but. Like that. Nice. But yeah, the, uh, there's something about the reward of bapping a spinner and having it go around. I think I've hit it twice, but I still managed to be well, Hit me orange do hickey a couple of times in the box there. Shot yeah. very well. Thank you, Goose. one shot well. I think it's probably, as Rafiki the wise old baboon once said, it is time. <laughs>